Hey guys, it's Toast from the Fish Yacker YouTube channel, and this is what I think is the most stupid lure I've ever come across. So guys, if you haven't been following along, I do a lot of reviews on really cheap, inexpensive fishing lures. I get a lot off of eBay, Wish.com, AliExpress, all over the internet. Seeing if any of these really super low budget, generic Chinese lures actually work. Once in a while I find a few that do. This one may work, but it's just stupid. Anyway, I found this on AliExpress. I overspent and paid a dollar and thirty-seven cents for it. It took quite a while to get to me. These usually take about a month to get to you from China. But I kept seeing this come up all the time when I was doing uh, like searching around online for cheap lures. Came one of these cheap Chinese e-packets. The packaging itself looks halfway decent. It's got this little blue shark on both sides of it. Uh, it is kind of resealable in a little Ziploc. And what is it? It's a little teeny tiny popper with a poo emoji on it. Looking at the packaging, it's got a lot of foreign language stuff. It says Lou Shazer as a brand. It's got some helpful hints on here. After saltwater fishing, wash the product with fresh water and dry it to save. Anyhow, packaging looks pretty cool at least. Let's open the thing up. Uh, like I said, it's a resealable little Ziploc package that comes in. And compared to a lot of them, it's a lot better packaging than a lot of those really cheap ones. Which they put more effort into the lure than the uh, packaging. So I can get it out of here. Teeny, teeny, tiny thing. This thing, again, is listed on AliExpress. It's got another one with really long titles in it for keywords. Luches, or whatever, I don't know how you want to pronounce it. Lushzer. Popper Fishing 2.5 centimeter, 1.2 gram. Angle in, angel in, uh, Waller fish crankbait lure fishing products, China hard bait fishing tackles, free ship. Yeah, it's free shipping, but you're still paying a buck thirty nine for something about half an inch long. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna do a quick review on it, take a look at it, but uh, I can't recommend this thing. Pretty funny looking if you want a little gag lure. That's kind of why I picked this thing up. It's got a little teeny tiny wire hook on it. And it's got a lot of flex and play in it. So if you catch anything bigger than a mini, mini, little teeny tiny trout on it, you're going to straighten that hook out. <laughs> it does have a split ring in the front and in the back. It's kind of got like a little matte finish on it. I don't know. Will it work? If you're catching something really teeny tiny, yeah. I mean, you, can, you know, I'm sure it'll float and sure it'll make a little pop in action, but it's so light. Good luck casting it. You'd almost want to throw it on a fly rod. Uh, the hook itself is going to kind of run at a side angle. It's not vertical or up or down. It's going to run at kind of a side angle. So you might get some snags on it if you're throwing around structure. It does have a nice little cup to it. I guess it's plastic. It's got a little seam down the middle, but it feels, you know, like I said, a matte finish on it. I don't know, guys. If you really want a gag gift, that might be pretty funny. But uh, you see how gigantic and enormous the thing is. Uh, but yeah, for maybe like a little fly popper. Or for a little trout, maybe. But like I said, if you're not throwing on a fly, you're going to have a hard time casting it. But will it catch anything? Probably. It's going to bend that hook out, though. So, so, I mean, seriously, I'm going to probably sit here right now. Let's see. There, he's bent the hook a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little wire hook. Anyhow, if you're really desperate for a little gag lure, that could work. 
I wouldn't try to fish with it, especially for that price. A lot of stuff we're finding is a lot cheaper than that and are actually pretty cool lures. But it's pretty funny looking. But it definitely looks a lot bigger in the pictures. <laughs> oh well, it's kind of funny. Like I said, I do these videos, I pick these up so that you uh, might not need to. And here's one for you. Like I said, you want to pull up a joke on somebody, go for it. But uh, yeah, yeah, anyhow, funny looking little lure. Anywho, we'll get some more of these coming to you. Uh, I'm sitting at home now because it's pouring down rain and raining all weekend. And uh, I kind of suffered through uh, a deluge monsoon yesterday. Anyway, click and subscribe, guys. Uh, let me know what you want to see. We'll get some more of these up for you. And we'll get on the water some more. And this coming week, I'll be in Old Forge, New York at Paddle Fest. So if you're up there in that area, swing by and take a look for me. I'll be hanging around all the Old Town kayaks. All right, guys. We'll catch you on the water. Fishyacker.com The original kayak rigging video series.